In the next five to 10 minutes, you are going to learn the easiest and fastest way of scraping leads in 2024. I am going to show you how we can get literally high quality leads for extremely cheap who haven't been messaged before by other agencies. Because I see it so commonly as a mistake, right, is people's client acquisition system is only as good as the actual inputs you put into it. So this could be your copy, correct. But what I see as a mistake is that the biggest constraint is actually the lead sourcing method. Because it doesn't matter how good your copy is. It doesn't matter how good your script is. If the actual quality of leads you're putting into the system is bad, it won't work. And your output is going to um, result in that. So your environment is everything. And you should know that a system is only as good as the highest constraint or the biggest constraint. And your constraint right now is probably your lead sourcing method, but also your script. But in this specific video, I'm going to explain two ways of finding high quality leads for pretty much free, and you can get thousands and thousands. Now, I'm going to be explaining two different ways of doing this. Now, on the left, we've got pool marketing. Now, pool marketing is essentially pulling leads um, and people into your offer opposed to push marketing, which is pushing our offer onto people. Now, my checklist for actual good leads are leads that haven't been recycled. So we're not reaching out to people who already have their guard up because if we are, then yeah, their guard's going to be up. They won't speak to us and they'll tell us to like, go away, basically. Um, we want to be able to find their personal email number, their first name, ideally, um, and then omnipresent platform. So um, all their information on Instagram, Facebook, LinkedIn, email, phone number, etc. So there are two ways we can do this. Um, I'm going to explain both of them because the, the reason I should actually explain is it depends on what niche you are in and that sort of plays a massive role in which one of these two you're going to go for. I'm going to go over push marketing first. So this, this is basically yeah, pushing our offer onto people. Now, if you are like working in your niche and it's an IRL business, meaning that you know it's a business in person that you know Google Maps actually like has, for example, roofers, real estate, med spas, gyms, lawyers, all these types of businesses are ones we can find on Google Maps. So the best way of getting all these businesses on Google Maps into a Google Sheets or a CSV file is going to be through these two um, softwares. And I'm going to explain exactly right now how easy this is. And make sure you watch to the end of the video because I'm going to be going over my exact pull marketing strategy that's getting me consistent lead flow every single day because a healthy business is one that yeah it has traffic it's got money coming in and out of it it's got good cash flow it's got good lead flow and i'm going to explain exactly how i do this um on instagram so keep watching but first of all i want to explain this so let's say right you're working with gyms just an example um you would want to target basically your local area just to start off and you would also want to target smaller gyms because if we just go for all gyms then we're going to get the big ones who have probably met, been messaged before. So what this would look like is you're essentially, as you can see, you're getting all these leads, but we need to get all this information into a Google Sheets to make it really simple. Now, how you do this is you'd want to copy the URL. You'd want to basically go to Phantom Buster. They have a completely 14 day free trial. You don't even need to put your card in. I'm not affiliated with them. This is purely just what I would use. Um, so you'd go here and you'd basically just paste that in um, and they've got examples here of what to do. So the URL of a Google map search. Um, and you'd basically save that. You would put, yeah, obviously you want English. Or if you're not English, then you put whatever country you're from. You'd put how many um, you want to scrape per search. I think the maximum you can do is 200 per search, but you can always do multiple searches. Um, you'd click save. You would basically want to select um, which ones you want. So let's just say you want all of them. You probably wouldn't want Twitter or um, YouTube, but you'd want phone numbers. Um, yeah, so this is perfect. You'd click save. And what you do, right, is you would click on and it would literally just scrape it for you. Um, and I'll show you in a minute. So as you can see, it's running the actual um, thing. Now, that's how that works, right? But yeah, as you can see, it, it, it takes time because it runs in the background of your PC. Um, and that's how that works. So it's super simple and it's actually free, but there are a bunch of other lead scraping softwares or like automation tools. If we actually go to, um, I don't know why it's not letting me. Okay, here we go. If we go here, you can see we've got instant data scraper. If we search the um, thing, you can see we've got data scraper, easy web scraping. There's so many 
like tools you can basically use that do the exact same thing. Um, but yeah, that's what I would use um, because the, the difference is, is I see a lot of people using like, um, and I'm not against platforms like Apollo and all these like softwares. They're, they're decent, but the problem is they're kind of like recycled. Meaning that if you put like real estate, um, like yeah, New York, you're going to get the same leads as you uh, you would basically um, as all the other people who do that exact same search who are in the same city as you and have the same offer basically. Um, so that is one way, right? If you're working with IRL businesses, it's super simple. You basically just use Phantom Buster um, and it's really easy to do. And as you can see, it's got success um, and it would basically just like, once it's done, it will show you all the results basically. But now let's go over my exact strategy here um, for pool marketing. So this is how can we pull people into your offer? And what I'm going to be explaining right is my Instagram strategy. So I'm actually giving it away. As you can see, right, let's say I do a post on Instagram just like this. And if you're not following my Instagram, what are you doing? You, be you better follow it. It's uh, Charlie Barber Biz. Um, but as you can see, right, 30 comments, um, all from qualified, marketing qualified leads. Now, what this looks like is this. Like, look how much attention and just qualified leads I get, basically. Um, and these are all marketing qualified leads, meaning that they know who I am. They think of me as, as an authority. They think of me as an expert. Um, and when we message them, we can quite literally just start a conversation and then book them in. And how this works, right, is we give them a free lead magnet. We have to create something valuable that we can give your niche for free. This could be a PDF. It could be a you know free training. It could be a free webinar. It could be anything like that. And what you would do, right, is the call to action in your short form content um, yeah, or emails or whatever you want should be um, to like drop a comment below and I'll send it over. So for example, comment the word meetings and I'll share with you exactly how I'm currently getting meetings. And then as you can see, people will comment and not only does this boost the actual algorithm because it shows Instagram that people are engaging with your post, it also um, yeah acts as like a way in which you can just DM them the free lead magnet, the reciprocity is there, they trust you, they know who you are, and then all you have to do is carry out a conversation and book them in. But I just want to mention, right, that this is so powerful that I'm quite literally closing deals in the DMs. So whilst a lot of people um, are like chasing leads day and night to try to just get a few meetings here and there, I'm closing thousands of dollars in the actual DMs through this method and through YouTube Organic. Um, so that's one thing to note. They're marketing qualified leads, which means they're a lot more you know, qualified than these ones, basically. Um, and this works best, right, if you're working with online businesses. So coaches, consultants, SaaS, a, uh, marketing agencies, this is what you have to do. Whereas if you're working more with like, yeah, roofing, um, yeah, these types of niches, and you can find them on Google Maps, then I would personally go with this method. But you could combine both pool marketing and push marketing to have the most effective client acquisition strategy. Um, so this is the cheapest form of uh, cost per lead in client acquisition, um, CPA, cost per acquisition. So that's what I would recommend. Like if you look at Hormozy and what he did to get leads, yeah, it was always like a $1 like book or um, a really cheap lead magnet that shows, um, you know, the the, the interest that the lead has and then you can obviously upsell them have an order bump um because you just want to make the or average order value um the same as the uh the lead basically sorry the ads um to cover the cost or break even and then you've got the data in addition but that's a story for another day where you can basically sell low ticket um offers if you're selling a high ticket offer but i won't talk about that now but because I, I don't want to confuse you guys but um yeah, these are the two methods you, you'll use. Um, I mean, it's the only two methods you can actually use, but I just wanted to go in depth into like how you'd get these leads for free, basically. Um, and this one, obviously, you can get an editor if you want, or you can edit it yourself, but there's no excuse to not be put doing this. Um, and if you're too scared to put like your face on camera and actually communicate your message out loud, because the most effective and, you know, the people who make the most money are ones that can communicate the best. So, if you're not willing to put your face on camera, then you should probably ask yourself, is this like for you? You know, like I, I don't care what I have to do. I, I'm going to have the impact I want, regardless if, you know, I have to put my face on camera. I do not care. I'm going to get the outcome I want. Now, hopefully this video helped you guys um, 
just give you some clarity around how to scrape leads for really cheap. Um, yeah, I don't want to talk too much. As I mentioned, it's just been a 10 minute video. Um, I wanted to make it short and sweet. But if you did like this video, all I ask in return is if you just like um, and subscribe, basically. If you want, you can comment what videos you want next on the channel. But yeah, like and subscribe. I'm trying to get to 10,000 subscribers. And obviously, the more subscribers I have, the more I can create better content and have guests and all these things on the channel. So yeah, hope you have an amazing day. Um, I'll put a few links in the description if you want to work with me. If not, no worries. Take care and I'll catch you in the next video.